here we are showing the second stage management of the case of hydrogenic left lower ureteric structure with multiple renal stones and ureteric stones this patient had multiple lower ureteric stones for which URSL was attempted outside failed the patient presented with urinoma and we have done ultrasound guided percutaneous nephrostomy with percutaneous drainage a week later the percutaneous drain was removed and it is now 3 weeks post operative we are planning for anti grade flexible ureteroscopy with left pcnl this is the ct kub showing the multiple renal stones and multiple stones in the proximal and lower ureter this is the nephrostogram picture and the siam showing multiple stones in the kidney in the lower calyx and the middle calyx through the nephrostogram initially contrast was injected through the nephrostogram initially guide wire was passed and the guide wire had coiled in the lower ureter dilatation was done the malicots was removed alkens rod was placed and serial dilatation was done up to 18 french and a 13 french nephroscope was used once we were inside the system but this nephroscope was a little big for the system and therefore it could not go into the lower calyx then we have changed the nephroscope to a 7.5 french one so with the 7.5 french nephroscope so this is the pelvis and now we are going into the lower calyx in the lower calyx that is the medial most lower anterior calyx two stones were there about 6 to 8 mm size these stones were basketed both the stones in the lower calyx were cleared once this was done the other calyces were inspected the scope was passed into the upper calyx which was clear and as we were withdrawing the scope in the parallel middle calyx another stone was seen this was also basketed out so to confirm there are no other stones in any parallel calyces flexible nephroscope was used through the amplar sheath and it was ensured that there was no other stone left in the any of the calyces now anti grade flexible ureteroscopy is done through the amplar sheath flexible ureteroscope is passed through the ureter and proximal ureter was normal and as we approach the lower part there were two stones which were basketed out this is the first stone being basketed and again this is the second stone which is seen so once both the stones were removed flexible scope was passed and at this point in the lower ureter the scope could not be negotiated further this is the luminal narrowing which can be seen and the contrast also could not be seen uh, distending the ureter so with this nephrostogram was a uh, nephrostomy was placed and procedure was completed he was planned for ureteric reconstruction with a boari flap or a ureteric reimplantation after 3 weeks thank you